The Devolutions Workspace Browser extension provides you with a secure way of using those vaulted passwords that are stored in Remote Desktop Manager, your Devolutions Hub, both personal and business accounts, as well as Devolutions Server, and insert them directly into your favorite websites using the browser of your choice. Now, in this video today, I'm going to give you a quick overview of its various features, as well as show you how to get started. So let's dive right in. So let's start by going to devolutions.net and then selecting the workspace product. Now, since we're looking at the browser extension, I'll select that. And then I'll scroll down and choose the browser of my choice and click download. Then I can add it to my extensions. And I normally like pinning it for easy access. Now to get started, I need to connect it to one or more spaces. For today's example, let's connect it to my user's hub personal as well as his hub business account. So for hub personal accounts, it's really easy. You just have to log in and authenticate using your Devolutions account. So that's what my user Maurice is going to do. Now that workspace and hub personal are connected, let's take a look at the interface. Now, depending on the space you are using, some of the icons on the left could change, but all of them will start off with the home section, which displays any passwords that are matching with the current website that you're on. Then there's the favorites menu, which is a quick and easy place for you to bookmark websites that you use the most often. Next, we have the all entries icon, which shows you all the contents of your vaults if you're using Devolutions Hub. But if you're using Devolutions Server and Remote Desktop Manager, they will show you website entries. And then we also have a handy password generator, which is a quick way for you to generate secure passwords on the fly. Then on the bottom left, we have the gear icon, which takes you to the configuration settings where you can easily customize how the browser extension works with each space. Now, for example, I can have my hub personal here automatically fill credentials when a page loads, making it a little bit easier. Okay, so Maurice's hub personal is set up. Let's also add his hub business account as well to access his business credentials. So if I go up to the top left and I hit manage spaces, here I can add spaces. So this time we'll be adding a hub business account. Then the first step here will be to type in the server address for that website. And then we will log in and authenticate it to connect it to the workspace extension, just like we did earlier. Great. Now, if I switch on over to the hub business account, you'll see on the left here that it's pretty much the same options, except for one difference. Instead of the all entries, we have vaults. This is where you can access your organization's shared vaults. But the first thing you'll have to do once you click it is you have to select which vaults you want to synchronize with Workspace Browser Extension. So here we'll just select a few vaults that Maurice wants to have access to. He can change this later on as well. Now you'll also notice that he has access to his user vault where Maurice can store his personal business credentials. So his Microsoft Office account, his Slack account, and other tools that he might use on a daily basis. Great, Maurice is all set up and ready to go. Now let's see it in action. The Workspace Browser extension interacts with websites in a variety of ways. If a website password already exists in one of the vaults, I can access it by manually typing in the website if a matching password is found, it will indicate it for me by the little icon in the specific field, like the username and password. Clicking on the indicator will reveal which credential was matched, as well as the little indicator in the browser extension will also show you the same information. Another popular method of using the browser extension is simply to browse the vaults and select the website entry that you want to access. For instance, I can click on this Microsoft login website and it'll take me directly there. Now, I'm already logged into my office account, but it'll insert my password for me, keeping things easy and secure. So accessing existing websites is quite easy, but what about adding new websites? Well, I can do so by manually creating one by hitting the plus icon and filling in the correct information. Or perhaps a better way is to let the browser extension create it for me. So all I have to do is visit the website, then type in the username and password. 
and then the browser extension will prompt me to save it to one of my spaces. I can even specify a specific folder if I want to organize it a little bit further. And you'll notice here that the indicator now shows that there is one entry. And if I go to my user's user vault, you can see that that entry was created automatically for him. Well, that's it. With Workspace Browser Extension, you get powerful, straightforward, and secure password insertion. So why don't you check it out for yourself and try it with your favorite browser today?